Come on, Yen Sid, just turn. I'm turning, I'm turning. Let me be done in a second before you start the truck, Merlin. Yeah, yeah. Ow. Oh, son of a bitch. What happened? Oh, it's nothing, Shiro. You cut yourself while you cut the freaking wires. I got them all fixed, Merlin. Turn on the truck and see what's working. On it. Come on. Darn it, this is why I don't get it started. Yen Sid, you big grump. Merlin, you better get your lazy butt and get her overhaul. Sheesh, are you not trying? Guys, I've been trying so hard getting her started while you said overhaul, Yen Sid. Guys, let's not just calm down. I'm sure we'll get it fixed. Emily's right. Should you guys try to think about it before we started her up? <sighs> okay, okay. We should get her started. Give us for 20 minutes. I told you, Marco got his god darn problems. Hey Judo, how about the couple of soda cans? Sorry, Makoto, I have to go. I got a message from my family last weekend or so. I need to get my sister Emily to call me back. You've been hanging out with your sister a long time, haven't you? Yes, but don't worry, Makoto, I'll be back by dinner at 8 p.m. Be sure to let me know that you come back. Don't worry, I will. By Makoto. Let's see what do we got here in Marco's database. Here's what I found. Wait, how come that his age is unknown? Byron, his age was currently unknown because he doesn't reveal his age. But we can see his sexuality. Did something happen? I don't know, but something odd about his sexuality, but it reveals to us raccoons and Saren and his friends is actually bisexual. I'm gonna ask him and see what he thinks. Hey, I know what's wrong with your truck. It's your useless control. I ever overheard on Porco's talk radio because you don't even need them. They're just and stupid, meanest egghead government's stupidest plot. How is cutting down on useless pollution a government plot, pet? Just open up your eyes, man. They're trying to control global warming. Get it? Global warming? So what, boys? That's code for UN commissars telling Americans what temperature it's gonna be in our outdoors. I just say you let the world warm up. See what Bluto thinks about that. Yup. We'll grow oranges in Ohio. Seriously? Patrick, you knucklehead. We live in Merlin's Friends Town Square. It's already 110 degrees in the summer. And if it gets one degree hotter, I'm gonna kick your ass. What the hell is that sound? Ozzy? Ozzy, honey. What do you know about sexual relations? I don't know. Nothing much. I'm a little bit worried about being a slut. Well, Ozzy, your brother and I decided that as your brother and your sister-in-law that you and I should have a little talk on the subject. You have noticed, I am sure, that, there are some pretty big differences between boys and girls. I'm sure you know that. I mean, physically, boys are. Well, they're different. They have something that girls do not have. Us raccoons have different feelings than our friends do, like emotions. Come on, Merlin, if you're gonna pop the soda. Your friends taught me everything, and in four different languages, too. What's your point? Well, the point is, there is no way Shiro's little brother is learning the how to teach about romance from some bureaucrat regulatory handbook. Well, it may be kind of tease, don't you? And that's why I'm trying to tell you. You're coming to a time in your life when you're gonna start to have tender feelings for a girl. You're gonna need to know what those feelings mean and what to do about them. Yeah, yeah, whatever.
right, I give up. I need to take Yen Sid's truck to get repairs. But how? I need to talk to Yen Sid for repairs to let him know what he thinks. You need repairs for my truck? Why? Because I need to work on your truck. Would you be happy about you may get the new one instead of this? I may want to think about it, but it may take a little bit longer than I thought. And Merlin, please calm your ass down, will you? I am calm down, Yen Sid. And that's why that I must tell you. You need to know about for a second there and you may be mad at suddenly, but don't you think that it's going to far for our argument is maybe over? Oh, suck my dick, Merlin. Fine then. Merlin? Is something wrong? You look sudden pissed. First, just watch your language, Baron. And second, I am mad because Yen Sid's argument is way too far this time, don't you agree? How am I not surprised? I still can't believe that you and Yen Sid argue so much like 27 years later, you need to know that I don't even know how to punish that. Maybe you should know that my hints are trying to tell him the truth. Good thing that I got hit right in the tail to get away from it. Well, good for you. What's the hint? So, my hint is that I need to go talk to Yen Sid for a minute, calmly. I shouldn't know that it was assumed that it was him, but I was wrong. I'll come back to you later. What the? Dang it. Still? HM? Who is it? So, let me get this straight. You want to talk to me? Look, Yen Sid. I know we didn't talk too much after 20 years, and yet, we still argue in the past about being with you guys, and you did nothing. Merlin, my friend, I'm happy for me and my friends, but I'm sad for you. But Merlin, listen, I'm a raccoon hybrid, but you're a wizard. And you make the new ways in your path beyond this within your heart. But not in your past, you know that, don't you? What do you mean? Merlin, I'm trying to say this, just draw strength from each other and follow your heart. It'll never fail you. And you didn't think about saving your ass out there because of your harshness. Look, I'm sorry for what I said. I was trying to get to protect you and your friends, and I did it because I cared about you. I shouldn't hurt your feelings, Yen Sid. I know that you actually raised Shiro, Emily, Makoto, Baron, Bandit, Kyle, and Akira. I know that I meet the worst, the worst thing that I ever met. I never done that after 20 years. And I try so hard to apologize to you, and I tried. Okay? Merlin. And just go ahead, give me your hate comments about me. I don't care. And you can actually feel about it. Merlin, nothing said about you. Jeez. Listen. I am not saying about you or anyone else. Then how come about what happened to us, my friend? After all we've been through? Look, Merlin. I'm sorry that you got mad for no reason. I cared for you. You promise? I promise, my friend. Thank you, Yen Sid. Anytime.